Jesus Christ, Billy, we gotta do something. Why? Who cares? We saw him. So? It ain't nothing to us. The kid's dead, so it ain't nothing to him neither. And who gives a shit if they ever find him? I don't. What is that kid they're talking about on the radio? Brocker, or Brower, or Flowers, whatever his name is. The train must have hit him. Big fucking deal. We had all followed the Ray Brower story very closely because he was a kid our age. Three days before, he had gone out to pick blueberries, and nobody'd seen him since. I think we should tell the cops. Yeah, don't go squawking to the cops after you boosted a car, you idiot. They're gonna wanna know how the hell we got way out on Back Harlow Road. Now they know we don't got no car. It's best we just keep our mouths shut, and then they can't touch us. Look, we can, we can make a nominous call. <sighs> they trace those calls, stupid. I seen it on Highway Patrol and on Dragnet. Yeah, right. I just wish we never boosted that goddamn Dodge. I wish Ace had been with us. Could have told the cops who was in his car. Well, he wasn't. Are we gonna tell him? We're not gonna tell nobody. Nobody, never. You take me. You shake my nerves and you rattle my brain. About this time, Charlie and Billy were playing mailbox baseball with Ace and Eyeball. Oh, shit, I'm out. God damn it. Shouldn't have gone for a wooden one. <laughs> Why don't you tell me something I don't know, asshole? Billy, you're up. Nah, you guys win. I don't want to play no more. Hey, you can't quit. We only played three innings. That would be a non-official game. Hey, hey, so... Uh, me... What's with you, homo? You've been acting psycho all day. What is it? It's nothing. Nothing. It's nothing, right? And if you gentlemen don't mind, I'd like to finish this game before I start collecting my goddamn social security, okay? You're up, Billy. Move it. All right, give me this fucking thing. Let's play ball! Yeah. <laughs> so it's still, will you? So, uh, what's with you and this Connie Palermo chick? Uh, I've been seeing her for over a month now, and all she let me do is feel her tits. <laughs> She's a Catholic, man. They're all like that. If you want to get laid, you got to get yourself a Protestant. Choose good. <laughs> a KLAM news break. We interrupt to bring you an update on the search for the missing 12-year-old Ray Brower. The police have expanded their efforts to include Mutton, Durham, and the outlying areas. Shit, when are they going to give the up? Indicated... Kid's gone. They're never going to find him. Not where they're looking. Hey, I was right, Charlie. They ain't never going to find him. Would you hold still? You're making me fuck up the snake part. I'll tell you how they're going to find him. Ten years from now, some hunter's going to go in the woods to take a leak, wind up pissing on his bones. I'll bet you a thousand bucks we find him before that. But you two thousand dollars, they don't. Well, asshole. Hey, what's the big deal? Who cares? Would you two just shut the fuck up? If either one of you assholes had two thousand dollars, I'd kill you both. Hey, we're back here with the boss man, Bob Cormier. From the racks and stacks, it's the best on wax. It's the Cornettes with Lollipop. <laughs> <laughs> Ace, I gotta tell you something, but you gotta swear in your mother's good name that you won't tell anybody. You got it, pal. Hey, eyeball. You know that brown kid? What about him? Well, I could tell you something about him, but you gotta swear in your mother's good name you ain't gonna tell nobody. Billy and Charlie had managed to keep their enormous secret for about 36 hours, a personal record for both of them. By noon, Ace and Eyeball had told their secret to everybody in the gang. I guess for those guys, protecting their mother's good name wasn't the top priority. Hey, listen, Ace, um, maybe me and Charlie shouldn't go. Yeah, maybe you can go without us, huh? You guys were acting like my grandmother having a conniption fit. I don't see your problem. We go up with a whole bunch of fishing gear, and if a cop asks us what we're doing there, we're just here to take a couple steelhead out of the river. And look what we found. Yeah, come on, man. We're gonna be famous. We're gonna be on every radio and TV show in the country. I still don't think we should go. Okay. Okay. You stated your position clearly. Now I'm gonna state mine. Get in the fucking car. Now! Let's go. Take out the papers and the trash! Not this time, man! No way! 
Go for it, Vince. Go, go for it. Don't finish, Vince. Let's go. I got him! I got him! Don't go down. You got him, guy! It's the ring! Fall back, Ace. Come on, I'm fucking around. And when you finish doing it, Jesus Christ, Ace, fall back, man! Come on, man, don't fuck around! Come on, Ace, fall back, man! Let him beat you, you cock knocker. <laughs> what the fuck do you know about this? Some bitch. My little brother. He wasn't planning on taking the body from us, was you boys? You get away, man. We found him. We got dibs. Oh, we better start running, eyeball. They got dibs. <laughs> We earned you, man. You guys came in a car. That's not fair. He's ours. That's not fair. He's ours. <laughs> well, not anymore. There's four of us, Eyeball. We just make your move. Oh, we will. Don't you worry. Fern, you little son of a whore. You was under the porch. No. No, I swear. It wasn't me. You little keyhole peeping bum. I found it. Beat the living shit out of you. have two choices. You either leave quietly, we take the body. Or you stay, we beat the shit out of you. We take the body. Besides, me and Billy found him first. Yeah, Vern told us how you found him. Oh, Billy, I wish we never boosted that car. Oh, Billy, I think I just turned my fruit of the looms into a fudge factory. That's oh. it. Your, your ass is grass. Hold it. Okay, Chambers, you little faggot. This is your last chance. What do you say, kid? Why don't you go home and fuck your mother some more? You're dead. Come on, Chris, it's split. They're not taking Come him. Come on, man, this is crazy. They're not taking him. He's got a knife, man. Ace, come on, man. You're gonna have to kill me, Ace. No problem. You're not taking him. Nobody's taking him. Come on, kid. Just give me the gun before you take your foot off. You ain't got the sack to shoot a woodchuck. Move Ace. I'll kill you, I swear to God. Come on, Lachance, give me the gun. You must have at least some of your brother's good sense. Suck my fat one, you cheap dime store hood. What are you going to do, shoot us all? No ways. Just you. We're going to get you for this. Maybe you will and maybe you won't. Oh, we will. I'm not going to forget this if that's what you're thinking. This is big time, baby. <laughs>